Today with Mark Ross, we're going to go ahead and work on painting a very pretty intake. Mm. And with that said, we have a very special magic concoction of acetone and ABS with a acid brush that we're going to go ahead and paint some uh, pretty pictures. And that's totally a lie. This is going to look ugly. But what you got here, some pretty cool stuff. It's made out of acetone and just general ABS plastic. So without further ado, let's go ahead and take you to the show. Now, what we're going to try to do here is create some pretty strokes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, look at those strokes. Mmm. So not pretty. But, we kind of even out. And so, one of the goals here, we're going to go ahead and kind of fill these cracks. And the end result is once all this dries, I'm going to go ahead and sand all this and make it look a little nicer. But really the end result is going to be I will finish it off and paint it after I do all the sanding and smoothing. Oh, poor bug. End of your life. Yeah, look at that sloppy goop. Mmm. You hungry? I kind of am. But, yeah. Let me go ahead and kind of keep painting all this, smooth it out. Now, <clears throat> one thing to keep in mind is as I'm doing this, what actually happens is because of the chemical and the viscosity, if you will, as it dries out, that's the acetone part, that's where it becomes a one-to-one -one weld. But in the process, it actually smooths itself out on its own. And we'll get some uh, before and after pics. Obviously, this is before, or technically halfway through. We've already got some other pics. And part of this progress. But you see, one of the things I'm doing here is I'm filling this little crack. And it's not really a crack, it's just a. Uh, yeah. Cosmetics. So, soon enough, uh, this will all smooth itself out on its own. And to, to a degree. Then I have to go through the process of smoothing it via sanding. And as said earlier, a little paint. Oh yeah, look at that smoothness. Oh, it's glorious. A little paint and we'll be good. We'll have a, a product, which for the record, I'm not going to sell. This is for Bonnie, not anybody else. But all right, check that stuff out, man. Or woman, more. If you identify as a fruit or a spoon, whatever. Yeah. That's right. Mark Ross. Not Bob Ross today. He's he's passed. And Bob Ross would have never painted with ABS plastic. But 
That's what I'm doing today. And we don't care about those drips. You didn't see those drips. But really, you did. And that's why I keep the jar down below. So, in case it happens, I'm covered. Better than Geico. Oh yeah, look at those little gaps you can fill. So that's pretty much the, the gist of how you do this. And we'll see what it looks like uh, tomorrow after it all dries.